Hello, my lovely mystical starlights. Welcome back to my YouTube channel, Mystical Mark. For those of you guys who do not know me, hello, hi, I'm Maria. Welcome to my channel. And hello to those of you guys who have recently subscribed, as well as those of you guys who have been with me since the very, very beginning. I'm very grateful, thankful, and blessed to be able to channel and to connect with you here once more today within this Karmic Masculine Collective reading. So we'll get into the detailings as to why I'm picking up this energy in regards to the collective that is listening to this. I do have some channeled messages from the dream state, from my own clairvoyant abilities, but we're going to get some more detailings on these situations that I am picking up through the tarot cards in just a little bit here, or even oracle cards, archangel cards, whichever ones are drawing out to me on the board here. Before I begin, I do wanna make an announcement that I am going to be doing a personal reading giveaway once I reach 900 subscribers, a little bit over 900 subscribers here on my YouTube channel. I will select a particular list of readings to choose from for the winner and once you pick which reading you like to go with, I'll get you scheduled in right away. And I also am going to be coming live here on my YouTube channel once I reach 1,000 subscribers. So please do stay tuned for that. For those of you guys who are wanting to book a personal reading with me, pretty soon I am going to be offering my rest of the year special spreads for 2024. So it's going to look into the remainder of 2024. Stay tuned for that. I more than likely will be putting out an announcement for that on my community tab here on this channel towards either mid-May or even the end of May going into the beginning of June. And also just for other regular booked readings, my email can be found within the description box. I will send you my services, prices, policies, and disclaimers for your review. Once you send me an email letting me know that you would like to book, and then once you read everything over and pick which reading or readings you like to go with, send me an email back and I will assign you a booked reading date and you will receive your reading anywhere from your booked reading date going into seven days after, not including weekends or holidays. So do keep this in mind. Without further ado, let's go ahead and get into the channeled collective messages on these karmic masculines. I am picking up here, these are going to be multiple masculines within your life. Some could be a little bit older than you, and for others of you, I'm getting masculines that are way older than you. I'm picking up here that masculines on the fraternal side of the family dynamic that may have been married into the family may be of relevance. I especially am picking up here that masculines in relation to dad, like I'm getting dad's brothers or sisters could be a relevance here if for some of you guys who have a parent that has siblings here especially if you have a dad that has siblings but I'm more so getting here a fraternal figure that has siblings in which a masculine married into the family like a masculine married the sister or whomever whatever they want to identify as I am picking up here as well that there could be a masculine from your past that you used to connect with that you used to date with for some of you guys you used to connect with this person intimately here there were a lot of dates that you could have went on or there was some sort of connection that went on for quite some time I'm getting here it could be more than one year you could have known this person for more than one year when it comes to going back to the fraternal side of the family dynamic I'm picking up here that this karmic masculine masculine may have Pisces placements or there could be something very watery even if they have water placements they may be non-emotional like they may not be very emotionally expressive they may actually be very dismissive I'm picking up here that when it comes to this older masculine in terms of the father side of the family for a lot of you guys I'm getting like an uncle figure here I'm picking up here that this uncle figure could be spreading lies within a community about you trying to say that you are slow or you're not well educated or there's something a little bit off about you when it comes to your intelligence and I'm picking up here it's just because they can't see what it is that you are intelligent or knowledgeable or passionate or skilled in I'm picking up here that because they may not understand what it is that you are studying or what it is that you are knowledgeable in they're trying to discredit it or they're trying to make it seem as if you have something a little bit off about you and this reading isn't to offend you guys this is to make you guys aware so that you could know what is going on around you. I'm picking up here that this masculine on the fraternal side of the family, they could actually be connected to 
the same community that you were born into. So I'm picking up here the same race, the same culture, the same traditional backgrounds here. I am picking up here that the bar, food, restaurant industry, it can be of relevance here. Doesn't have to be, or I'm picking up here that this masculine could hang around a community in which you're also a part of, but you may not be so close to this community, even if it's from the same traditional or cultural backgrounds. So let's try to see, you know, why this karmic masculine energy is coming up to begin with. The Five of Wands wanted to like pop out just now, as well as the Knight of Cups coming out in the reverse. I am picking up here that with the Knight of Cups coming out in the reverse position. For some of you guys here, I'm actually picking up that this uncle could be defending you. So it kind of is kind of messed up because I am picking up here that they could be telling somebody, you know, within your guys' community, within the same community that you guys are a part of, the same traditions, cultures, they could be telling somebody that you're a little bit off or you're a little bit out there because they don't want somebody that is lying or seducing in nature to come towards you. But I am picking up here the that this uncle figure could need to be careful because even though you know they're trying to save you from whomever this is here with the knight of cups coming out it's like this knight of cups can know others and they may relay this information to other people and then for others of you guys here i'm picking up that this uncle figure here regardless of their age they act out in a very immature or they act out in a very dramatic way here with the knight of cups coming out i am picking up here that also they could be trying to start some sort of drama or trying to start some sort of conflict for some of you guys it is that they are trying to start some sort of drama or they are trying to start some sort of conflict when it comes to your love life is what I'm picking up here so it could go either or way for some of you guys here this karmic masculine uncle is for you and they're just trying to protect you and for others of you they are trying to I'm, I'm picking up here that they're trying to cause some sort of disarray or they're trying to cause some sort of sorry about that you guys my phone just cut off on me because I my storage is going a little bit crazy right now but yeah going back into this message I'm picking up here that these masculines definitely don't want you to know what's been going on within the background scenes and some of you guys here this uncle figure or this person on the father's side of the fam I'm picking up here that sometimes they could be coming in with some sort of gestures or offers here but they're they're inauthentic they're ingenuine is what I'm picking up from spirit I'm picking up here that they could be coming in with certain offers to you know make masquerade or to basically mask what it is that they are hiding from you i'm picking up here for some of you guys with the seven of pentacles at the bottom of the deck and the moon card coming out i'm picking up here that also they could be trying to like put the energy on you or put the focus on you so that they don't pay attention so much to them because they could be hiding something in regards to money here i am picking up here that they could also be you know trying Trying to deplete your money they could be trying to deplete your finances I'm also picking up here that they could be trying to act like um, they don't dibble and dabble into certain things here or I'm just picking up here I would be careful of certain foods or drinks or beverages here that are offered from this particular individual I'm getting here also Pisces cancer placements could be irrelevant for some of you guys here this uncle figure could be trying to act like you are doing things under the moonlight here I'm picking up here they could also be discussing your sexuality here or they could be trying to configure out I don't know what is what is their business but I am picking that up here it's like because maybe some of you guys are more so to yourself or you keep your love life to yourself they could be trying to act like you are you know for the for the same team in terms of love or it could be the opposite way around I'm just picking up here that they are waiting for something to come to light in regards to you and for others of you guys here I'm picking up that they're helping you out in a sense because because somebody that's been waiting to come towards you, they keep on getting delayed because this uncle figure is protecting them from coming towards you here with the moon card coming out. I'm also getting here something about red hair could be of relevance as well. I'm also picking up here that there could be some sort of incoming message or secret again that they are wanting you to not receive here. I'm picking up here also that this uncle figure or this fraternal figure here, they could have a son um, that is always 
caught in the midst of some sort of chaos and that could be as to why they're trying to blame certain things on you or they could be trying to blame certain mishaps or family problems on you when it's really them creating their own problems is what I am picking up from spirit. Let's try to get some more insight here. For some of you guys, if this is not an uncle figure um, or somebody on the father's side of the family here, I am picking up here that this could be in regards to like a family friend and a sisterly figure of theirs here. I'm picking up here that they could be purposely wanting to come in with some sort of lie or they could be purposely trying to cause lies about you so that people come, don't come towards you here. I am picking that up as well. So for some of you guys, this could be somebody that you consider to be like a cousin or like a friend that you that's like family here is what I'm picking up let's see what is going on here I'm getting here that ages ending in a seven could be irrelevant somebody you may have a seven year age difference with or that you've known for seven years moon tats and um, I'm also picking up sun tats could be of relevance as well we have you are not as serious as you should be, time to get serious. I'm picking up here that this uncle figure here could be trying to say that you're always partying or you're always having fun, but in reality, it's them always partying or it's them always having fun. If this is, same thing, if this is like a cousin figure or family friend here and it's like them, it's this masculine and their sister here is what I'm picking up. I'm picking up here, they're not as serious and they need to focus more so on themselves rather than trying to create some sort of drama or lies or illusions within your own life. For some of you guys here, this masculine could like to smoke. I am picking up here for some of you guys here, this masculine could be balding. They could be also um, have like sideburns or side hair, but they're bald in the middle is what I'm picking up from spirit. I also have this card right here, which says a young white man will inevitably intervene in your life. So again, for some of you guys here, this person is trying to stop somebody that could be more so pale in skin tone or complexion. They could be white. They could be Caucasian here. I'm picking up here that for some of you guys, this uncle figure is protecting you from somebody that isn't so serious that is wanting to come towards you. It could also be the same case for this family friend, um, this cousinly figure within your life here. However, for others of you guys, this person right here is trying to cause problems within your life here. And for the majority of you here, I'm picking up that this person is trying to cause problems. I'm picking up here though that there is older and younger energy being thrown into the mix here when it comes to these karmic masculines that I am picking up. So let's get some more insight here on who these individuals could be within this given situation here. For some of you guys, if there's a younger masculine involved in terms of your love life within this equation, I'm picking up here that they're not balding. They could have um, hair. For some of you guys, they are, um, but they're older than you. This card right there said young. So for some of you guys, you're dealing with an older masculine that is losing a little bit of their hair. And for others of you guys, you're dealing with somebody that is more so younger in terms of love. We do have likes to wear hair up. So for some of you guys here, I'm picking up if these masculines are connected to feminines, they could like to wear their hair up or you yourself could like to wear your hair up. For some of you guys, these masculines may have longer hair is what I'm picking up from spirit. We also have back dimples, but they came out in the reverse. They could have came out in the reverse here because you could have already disconnected from one of these individuals that I'm picking up. And let's get one more. I'm also getting something about the back. I'm picking up here that these masculines could be experiencing back problems or they were, and maybe you were experiencing some sort of back problems here. We also have larger tattoos as well. Let's get a couple more. We also have fun, unique embellishments, accessories, earrings, bags, purses, rings, bracelets, necklaces here. I am picking up here that for some of you guys, these masculines could be saying that you shop too much, um, you worry too much about like the fancier things in life or things that don't really matter here. They could be just jealous that you know how to style yourself. I'm also getting L names, you guys could be a relevance. S names, B names could be a relevance. I'm also picking up here places with letters that start with those letters could be of relevance. I'm also picking up here A names could be of relevance. Let's see if there's any other letters that I'm picking up. I don't think so right now. For some of you guys, they could be upset about certain piercings that you have, you know, just stupid stuff is what I'm picking up from spirit or I'm picking up here stupid hate. We also have gray colored eyes and traditional tattoos. So definitely heavy on the tattoos here. T names could be of relevance. Again, some of these may resonate with you. 
Let's get some more cards on the board. Yeah, for some of you guys, I'm definitely picking up here that this this older uncle uncle figure or um this this cousinly figure here, they could be trying to, you know project whatever's going on within their life when it comes to their kids on you for some of you guys here or when it comes to their siblings on you let's see here we have the telemarketer debt collector card coming out as well for some of you guys here these people are too invested in terms of your finances here they need to worry about their own finances for some of you guys this person owes you money whether you know it or not and for others of you guys here i am picking up that you could be trying to pay off your debt at this given moment here and these individuals are trying to distract you by causing some sort of drama for some of you guys here these this these individuals could be mad that you are into fashion or for some of you guys you could be if it's not fashion you could just be going through some sort of career change or you could be exploring Exploring multiple avenues or outlets and these people may not understand that there could be great benefits or abundance to come out of these particular avenues here and so instead of supporting you instead of cheering you on in the background scenes I'm picking up here that they are bashing on you they're trying to say like what you're doing is a waste of time that it's not going to bear the fruits of your labor and these are all lies because the knight of cups came out in the reverse for a lot of you guys you're definitely dreaming about these individuals or you will be dreaming dreaming about them within the coming days. For some of you guys here, I'm definitely picking up that there also could be some sort of secrecy when it comes to some of these masculines in terms of their practices or in terms of what it is that they're doing behind the scenes. They could be involved in some sort of scandalous things. For some of you guys here with the director card coming out, I am picking up here. They want to be the ones to call the shots within your life. They want to direct your life. They want to be in control of your life here. For some of you guys here, the film, the media industry could be irrelevant. Cancer placements could be irrelevant. Um, Aries Taurus placements could be irrelevant. Pay attention to whenever the next Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, Aries, or Taurus seasons are within this, within um, whenever you are listening to this, within that given year or within the year to come, whenever it is that you are listening to this reading. I'm picking up here for some of you guys, there could be some sort of news or some sort of information to come out about a death. I am picking that up as well. Maybe for some of you guys, there's some sort of money owed to you when it comes to some sort of um, debt here. I feel like a lot of you guys are sensing something is not quite right in regards to these masculines here and you're dreaming about it is what I'm picking up from spirit. I'm also getting dates or birth dates ending in a five could be a relevance as well. We have pilots coming out here. I spelled it wrong, but I am picking up here. For some of you guys, you could have these people on do not disturb. Um, for some of you guys here, these are people that are at a distance from you. For some of you guys here, I'm picking up. There could be something that has been hidden about a trip or maybe one of these masculines. Maybe something happened when they were on a trip here is what I'm picking up from spirit. We have babysitter coming out as well. I am picking up here. Yeah, I'm, I'm getting here. Their objective is to treat you like a kid. Their objective is to, for some of you guys, these people even want to, it's giving like um, Britney Spears when she was under her convertership. I think that's what they're called. And it's like these people want to have total control over your finances, your money, and the moves that you make in life here with the babysitter card coming out. Um, for some of you guys here, this person could be hiding a secret about a baby within the family dynamic here. For some of you guys here, maybe something happened in regards to when you were younger when it comes to certain of these individuals that they don't want to come to light. I'm picking up here for some of you guys, these people could be doing illicit things in terms of substances here or creating illicit things in, in terms of substances here. Um, and I'm picking up here again, they are trying to mask whatever it is that they're doing by focusing more so on you. For some of you guys, they could be saying that you're into certain things of this nature as well. I'm picking up here for some of you guys, they could be trying to say that you're in like sex working or and even if you are or not, I don't really care just as long as you're being safe. But I am picking that up as well. They could be saying that you're doing something of this nature online for those of you guys that are just really confident in your body they could have a problem with that it's just stupid stuff and I feel like spirit is trying to bring these energies to your attention so that you could identify as to whom they are and so that you're more secretive when it comes to these individuals here I feel like spirit wants you to stop telling these people your business and I am picking up here that spirit wants you to make moves in silence here is also something that I am picking up as well t names is also coming up too 
yeah, we have cashier, but it wanted to come out in the reverse. I am picking up here with the cashier card coming out in the reverse. It's like these individuals are not wanting you to get to the bag. They're not wanting you to get to the money here. I'm picking up here. There could literally be, for some of you guys, you could have money in an account overseas somewhere. That is something that I am picking up from Spirit with the cashier card coming out in the reverse. For some of you guys here, this person could steal money um, from like, I'm picking up ATMs, cash registers here. I'm, I am picking that up here with the cashier card coming out in the reverse. I also have accountant coming out. So for some of you guys here, I am picking up that this person could also be trying to look into your accounts, your social media accounts. It could be trying to look into your actual bank accounts here, or they don't want you to know something about their money, their bank accounts, because something could be owed to you is what I am picking up from Spirit. At the bottom of the deck, I have life insurance agent. For some of you guys, they, these individuals could have taken out a life insurance insurance policy on you um, or they could have done something in order to inherit somebody's life insurance here their life insurance money is something that I am picking up from spirit as well L names could be of relevance first middle or last initials here let's go ahead and conclude your reading by getting some advice getting some guidance some insight here for some of you guys there's definitely something about um, somebody that could be I don't know if this is in relation to your guys's channeled messages here but I definitely pick up here that there could be something in relation to somebody that could be in the medical field, um, somebody that could be faulty in their practices in terms of surgery, in terms of cosmetic surgery even. I'm getting something in regards to back. Back surgery could be a relevance here. Eye surgery could be a relevance here. I'm picking up here that there could have been something that went south when it came to somebody that was around their um, like late teens going into mid-20s when it came to a feminine energy in regards to a surgery that went south. Maybe even when it comes to abuse is what I'm picking up as well. I'm also picking up here something that could have went south in regards to an un unaliving when it comes to a maternal figure that is also something that i'm picking up from spirit or i'm picking up here that for some of you guys here there could be something about self-defense here i feel like just in all spirit wants you to be on your defense when it comes to these karmic masculines because you may not know them as much as you think that you know them they may have a whole other like secret or double life for some of you guys here there's definitely a masculine that is offering you things that have some sort of magic attached to it i am picking that up high key um taurus gemini placements could be of relevance as well i'm also picking up here Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio placements could be irrelevant. Leo is wanting to come out. Let's actually look a little bit more into the energy that I was picking up in terms of somebody that you used to connect to in love from the past because I also want to look into their energy as well, trying to see what spirit is, is trying to say in regards to them. So let's see here. We have the King of Wands coming out. For some of you guys, I'm just picking up here that this masculine could be, you know, thinking more so from down there than in their headspace. I'm picking up here they could be waiting to connect with you intimately here. For some of you guys, they could be doing sex magic on you. I am picking that up as well. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius placements could be a relevance. Ages ending in a seven could be a relevance as well as somebody you may have a seven year age difference with or that you've known for seven years. I'm also getting 1976, 1967 could be a relevance. For some of you guys here, I'm picking up that this masculine in the past from your love life, they could have been always feeling insecure because they could have felt like your destiny was bigger than theirs. They could have felt like your work, your career life was something that they couldn't be up to par with is what I'm picking up here. I'm also picking up here their friends, their atmosphere. They could have felt like, you know, their their atmosphere wasn't something that you would want to be a part of because it was toxic or negative in some sort of sense or way. And I feel like this masculine is finally waking up to the friends that they keep, the company that they keep. And I feel like now they are wanting to come back towards you. For some of you guys, you could have known this person for seven to six years or six to seven years is what I meant to say. For 13 years, the number 13 is coming out as well. Ages ending in a six could be a relevance as well. Somebody may have a six year age difference with or that you've known for six years. For some of you guys here, I'm picking up here something in regards to a rent to property, space, house. I'm picking up here maybe this person owes you something in regards to rent to property, space, house on a more minimal scale. This person could owe you something that you left at their house is what I'm picking up. I'm also picking up here that this person could want to, you know, marry you, um, be committed to you. But again, there is some sort of distance or some of you guys may have already moved on. 
from this individual here. For some of you guys here, this person could have been stuck in a, a marriage or a home, a family life here in, there, in which there was unreciprocity that they could have been hiding from you. Um, I'm picking up here, there could have been a lot of anger within this, this connection that they were a part of while having you on the side or while trying to maintain a connection, a whole connection with you. I'm picking up your dates or birth dates. Ending in a four could be a relevance as well. We also have the Ace of Pentacles coming up here. Definitely some, either you or this masculine could be coming into, I'm picking up a rented property, space, vehicle, house here. I'm picking up here, this masculine could also want to get you pregnant here. So some of you guys can need to be wary. For some of you guys, there could have been something in regards to pregnancy that was highlighted in the past when it comes to you and these masculines. I'm getting 1960, 1961. Could also be irrelevant or just 60, 61. Maybe that's an amount to something uh, or like 16,000, 61,000, um, 6,000, 1,000. I'm, I'm getting numbers like so could be irrelevant. I also have the Knight of Pentacles, but it came out in the reverse. So yeah, it's like this. I feel like the Spirit's highlighting all these pentacles here and all this fiery energy because this person talks up a big game. This person could even be trying to talk up a big game to their friend, trying to put on a persona or they could be even this friend group they could be acting all um, macho mighty and high here but they really don't have it like that is what i'm picking up here i'm also picking up here that they could be slow to paying something at this time um to the point where they may not have the resources that could also be what i'm picking up like maybe they did invest into a rented property space a vehicle a car here but i'm picking up here they may not be able to pay it for some of you guys here they, they, this masculine could be trying to stop you from coming into new beginnings they could be wishing for your money to be slow. They could be wishing for you to not invest into new things such as a car, such as a house, such as a rented property here. I feel like nonetheless, it's going to come into play for you with these combination of cards coming out. Ages ending in a one could be a relevance as well or zero. Somebody may have a one year age difference with or that you were connecting to within the past years. April birthdays is also coming up from Spirit. Let's get some of these cards right here. Let's see. White Plated Shirt, Rome, Lizzie McGuire movie, My Roman Empire, TikTok Coliseum Architecture. So I am picking up here with this card coming out. Somebody that could be European may be a relevance for some of you guys. The name Lizzie Elizabeth could be a relevance as well. I am picking up here places or investments in regards to like I'm picking up your architecture when it comes to like white columns could be a relevance here or I'm picking up here like Roman styled villas or houses something like that is coming up from spirit and then we do have this card right here but it came out in the reverse position in the upright it says Greece, Greek yogurt, places with white buildings or architecture, but it came out in the reverse. I am picking up here, maybe you guys have talked about going to Greece or maybe you guys went there in the past. I'm picking up here that maybe they want to go somewhere of this nature with you with this card coming out, but that is what I'm seeing there. For some of you guys, one of these masculines from your past could be coming back and actually offering you some sort of trip. For others of you guys here, this could just be something that they discussed, but they never fell through with it because, or it fell through because they never were, you know, in that energy of being able to even give this to you. I'm picking up here, they were lacking in some sort of sense or way. For some of you guys, this could be somebody brand new that is meant to come into play. For some of you guys, there is somebody that could be European, Grecian, Italian. I'm picking up here. I, I am picking up here Latino, Latina for some of you guys here. Or again, these types of cultures could resonate from somebody you were dealing with in the past. I'm picking up here that there's somebody could like to wear the color white here. That is also something that I'm picking up. Or this person could owe you something in the color white is what I'm picking up here. Like maybe you ha they have your white shirt or your white tennis shoes. Something like that is coming up from spirit let's try to get a couple more cards here and then i'm going to close out this reading let's see we have the delivery drivers coming out so i'm picking up here that the these masculines here from your past especially one in particular they could want to deliver you a message but again there could be some sort of blockage or maybe they felt like they took their sweet time d names could be a relevance they could want to actually some of you guys may receive a delivery from this person is what i'm picking up here 
We also have the, oh, we have the mailman coming out in the reverse. For a lot of you guys, it's more so like in terms of they want to deliver you something like a text message, social media message here. For some of you guys here with the mailman coming out in the reverse, one of these masculines could have taken something. They could have taken your mail. They could have taken your belongings here is what I am picking up from spirit. Maybe they don't want to mail you something that is owed to you. That is something that I am picking up as well. Somebody that may do hair may also be of relevance here. There could have been something significant about um, this person's hair. We have telemarketer, debt collector, and the reverse. This person could be ignoring their debt um, or they could be wanting to come back towards you because they are paying off their debt and they finally could have some resources to give unto you. I don't feel like you wanted this person like for their resources, but they felt like because they had less than, they had an act out in a shady way instead of just telling you what was up when it comes to what it is that they were going through financially. For some of you guys here, I'm picking up that this person wants to plan some sort of event with you or I'm picking up here that for others of you guys, you may for some of you guys, this person wants to plan an event with you, but they want to pay for it to make up for things. For others of you guys here, you're going to meet somebody new at an event or I'm picking up here at um, something that you may be throwing or there could be some sort of event that you may end up meeting somebody new at in terms of your love life. Um, so don't settle for whomever this is here that's been playing games. For some of you guys here, this person is purposely wanting to um, transmit something to you in terms of sexual diseases here or even a spiritual disease here. So be careful of that. I'm picking up here that for some of you guys here, this person could have something that they purposely want to give to you, okay? We also have minimalist style coming out. We have fun, unique embellishments, accessories, earrings, bags, purses, rings, bracelets, necklaces. For some of you guys, this person could want to gift you jewelry or this person could like to wear a lot of accessories or you may. That's the second time that that came out. We also have unique ear piercings and big round eyes. At the bottom of the deck, we have nose piercing. So let's close out this reading with some Archangel messages here. So that you guys could get some overall advice when it comes to these karmics that I have picked up for today's collective messages. Let's see here. Actually, I want to see really quick like what's going on with that energy when it came to somebody that was like malicious in their practices in terms of um, something that they perform. Like this is somebody that could again be a surgeon. I'm picking up here. Some of you guys just need to be careful in general when it comes to who it is that you go to for surgeries, for cosmetic things. That is something that I am picking up from spirit. We have the two of pentacles coming out here. I'm picking up here that this person, this surgeon, this person that it doesn't have to necessarily be a surgeon, but I'm picking up here somebody that provide some sort of services or market certain things. I feel like something's going to blow up in their face here. They're juggling too many things. There's too many things that are being found to the light here or coming to the light here in terms of financial prospects in relation to this person. Aquarius placements may be irrelevant for some of you guys. Something may catch on fire when it comes to this person. I am picking up your ages. Any in a two could be irrelevant. Somebody may have a two-year age difference with here that you've known for two years when it comes to this person. I'm also getting like the hip, the stomach area could be irrelevant to the legs, the arms. I'm just getting something in relation to the physical body that could have been affected by this person in some sort of sense or way. We have these star card coming out. I feel like nonetheless, you guys are going to be healing within this given situation. For those of you guys that may have been affected by somebody of this nature, or I am picking up here that with the star card, your dream is going to be telling you about somebody of this nature. This, this last message isn't going to be for everyone. I am picking up here though, in regard to the whole collective that is listening to this, with the star card coming out, don't worry about these masculines because I am picking up here. That is their objective. They want you to worry. They want you to sit in anger or resentment or in guilt because they want you to see them in a higher regard than that they're not is what I'm picking up here. They don't want you to come into this star energy, but the joke's on them because you're going to come into this star energy anyways by focusing on yourself, by focusing on your health, by focusing on your mental health, your emotional health, your physical health here. I am picking up here. Some of you guys are going to be that girl or that guy, whatever the case may be. Gender doesn't matter, but my feminines that are listening to this, you're going to come into healing and there is going to be something that you are going to reach success in within this given situation. The month of May could be irrelevant the next five months. I am picking up here. Libra placements could be irrelevant for some of you guys. Eventually, this person's going to be sitting in sorrow. They might end up pissing their pants here because they're going to have some sort of judgment call on them is what I am picking up from spirit. 
do feel like for some of you guys, this person is going to be getting in trouble legally or financially. Let's see here. We have the Queen of Ariel here, and we also have the Ace of Ariel. Yeah, I'm picking up here that... For a lot of you guys here, you are needing to continue to focus on being your happy, bright self here. Regardless if you feel that way as of right now, I'm picking up here that a lot of you guys are meant to come into a new energy in terms of stability. For some of you guys, I'm picking up that whomever this uncle figure is attached to, the feminine within the, the family dynamic here, they could actually be coming in with more love or more support after the fact. I am picking up here as well that this could be you. You guys could be coming off very mature regardless of these situations with these masculines that you've had to endure. I'm picking up here whether it's within fam, whether it's within love. I'm getting here. It's made you more practical, more wise, more mature, and it's also shown you what does bring you happiness and what doesn't bring you happiness. So at this time, you're being advised to nurture yourself and those that you love and that show love to you, not that show you fake love, okay? I'm hearing fake love straight up to my face by Drake. That's coming up very strongly. It says the ability to make anything more beautiful, practical, and wise advice. And I am picking up here, the more you focus on making your, your life beautiful, others, other people's lives beautiful around you that show you love, the more you're going to come into positive emotional shifts and experiences. Some of you guys have a new love experience coming into play. Some of you guys have a new family experience coming into play here it says a positive new emotional experience fulfilling romantic relationships deep and lasting spiritual insights so no matter who is talking here i'm picking up nonetheless you guys are still going to come into new positive emotional experiences especially in terms of love or in family here so that is all i got i'm also getting taurus virgo capricorn water placements could be a relevance when it comes to people that may come into play that are bringing in positivity i keep on getting here also um age is ending at a two somebody may have a two-year age difference with that you've known for two years january june july august birthdays could be irrelevance or those months could be irrelevance as to when this positive energy is meant to come into play the yin and yang symbology could be a relevance here to some of you guys i'm also picking up here look at this at the bottom of the deck there's coliseums coming up on this card also i am picking up here that a masculine that may relate either to these new emotional experiences or from these past experiences here are the people that are chit-chattering that are just drama that are just distractions they could be very into fitness or they could have a lot of muscles to them they could like to wear like baggy or draped type of clothes or maybe you do i'm getting like renaissance energy as well here but yeah you guys i'm picking up here also um there's definitely either you or a masculine around you that is freeing themselves from a very very difficult to work situation and i am picking up here once either you or this masculine frees themselves is as to when you're going to start to see a turnaround some of you guys may end up seeing like um, building or architectures with white columns. I'm picking up here anything that's like renaissance -y. I'm picking up here. That is as to when you're going to start to experience new positive emotional shifts. So keep an eye out for that. But that is all I got for you, my lovely mystical starlights. I hope you guys like this reading. Please give it a thumbs up if you do. Subscribe to my YouTube channel if you have not already. Again, once I reach 900 subscribers, a little bit over, I am going to be doing a personal reading giveaway. I will give you a list of readings to choose from. And then whichever one you do choose i will get you scheduled in right away once i reach 1000 subscribers i will be coming here live on youtube click the bell notification to be notified as to when i upload videos like so comment now or come back and comment down below on whether this reading resonates with you or not and if you're wanting to book a personal reading with me all you have to do is find my email within the description box of this video. Once you send me an email, I will send you my services, prices, policies, and disclaimers for your review. Once you read all of that over, send me an email back on what it is that you would like to schedule, and I will assign you a booked reading date, and you will receive your reading anywhere from your booked reading date going into seven days after, not including weekends or holidays. So do keep this in mind. And that is all I got for you guys. I'm wishing you guys nothing but great love, great health, abundance, luck, success, prosperity, joy, and blessings to come. Bye.